Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out my channel. Today we're going to be working on uh, F-150 and this is going to be applicable to quite a few F-150s from 2004 to 2011. And that is if you have a situation where your blower motor is doing this. Uh, the key's on. You can see that on speed number one there's nothing. Speed number two there's nothing. Number three nothing. Number four everything works good. And what that is, is a blower motor resistor. And uh, I'm going to show you how to install it. It's not very hard, and it's about five minutes worth of work. So stay tuned. Okay, the first thing you're going to need is an 8 millimeter socket. And some sort of a ratchet to remove the bolts that hold the blower resistor in. I'm going to use a uh, power tool, but you can use just a standard ratchet. Okay, you're going to get to this by going behind the glove box and what you have to do is there's a couple of tabs on the side you got to depress the plastic in and it'll allow the glove box to drop. Once inside the glove box you can see there's the blower motor resistor right here. I mean it's literally within a hand's width from where the door sets. So we'll go ahead and remove these two 8 millimeter bolts and it'll pull straight out okay so there's the two screws that came out you can see they're not very long they're kind of a, a fast thread and now this piece will just slide right out and there it is so what we'll do at this point is we'll go ahead and uh, remove this tab the wire connector and install the new one All right, so here's the new one, and you can see the printed circuit board on there. And all it does is send the signal through a little bit longer path from each speed. We're going to go ahead and hook it to the connector and slide it back in the hole that it pulled out of. Okay, so I put the connector back on. And we're going back to the hole that it came from. And we're just going to slide it in there. Some instruction. Yeah. Okay, so it's all buttoned back in, so we'll go ahead and turn the key forward and let you hear the fan. You can see it's already running on low. There's two, there's three, and there's four. All of them working, huh? So that's it. All right, so there goes another happy customer. In this case, the uh, part number that I used, I'm gonna put a link down below. It's all the same again, like I said, for 2004 to 2011 F-150s. Uh, click the link below and have it shipped to you, and you can see the steps were relatively easy. Thanks for watching, bye.